So, we're just going to start off with some joint circles, so let's mobilise the ankles. And one way and the other. Change legs. So today with our weights we're going to focus on upper body a little bit. Okay, let's get the knees going. Hop wise and over to the right. Anti clockwise and over to the left. Centre. You've got your club tee on. Very nice. So this race was a club race, so as we're coming through the you know checkpoint and everything, it's like, so you've been some stragglers. <laughs> but unfortunately I'm the only one in my team, so there was no team prize. And hip circles. Scrambling. So. Yeah. <laughs> it's not the scrambling, the scrambling's good. It's the coming down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I've lost count, but let's do 10 squat jumps. Okay? And then change another way. 
other person is going to do a squat and a calf raise. Okay? So you know what you're doing. Squat and calf raise. Let's get the timer started. Okay, are we organised? Right leg back, let's go. Chest up. Keep it controlled, get those elbows coming back. I don't know if you've ever had it after a race. You think, oh, that was, that was not too bad. Then I was trying to do something with your arms. Thought, oh, these don't work. <laughs> this is good to really imprint. So let's change legs, imprint that rear elbow drive. And time on the mat, you're going to do squat alternating calf raise. Okay, we're going to do the same again. Are we ready? Right leg back, let's go. Really drive those elbows back, don't let the arms come too far forward. Stay in our squat. Stay in the squat. You can tell me when you're beginning to be there. I'll be all <laughs> Chest up. Let's get the elbows swinging back, We're not having the arms coming forward, so the elbows swing back like we want to do with our running form. Change legs. Picking up, chest up. And swap with your buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Up onto our toes, nice and controlled. Bring the arms back, bring the elbows back. Don't want to imprint bringing them forward. Change legs. Chest up. Focus on that shoulder mobility. We should have a picture of you and Sarah in your lovely, lovely marathon. Oh. We're showing everybody. No, this is what we this is why we're not that fast. We're not doing this. <laughs> Alright, we have a little rest. And squatters, we're staying low, we're going for single single leg calf race. Let's go. Runners, left leg back. Chest up. Drive those elbows back. Let's get a bit lower into our squat. Change legs. Alright, to avoid all the swapping, those with the weights keep hold of their weights and they're going to do lunge, twist, press and then just stay on that side. For the rest of us, we are going to do running legs. So like so, like so. Let's go. We're going to be twist to lunge, twist to your, um, to the side of your front leg, and press. Press okay. to the top, and then, yeah, back into it. So same leg. Sorry, it's complicated. Sorry not to go there. <laughs> just thought it would be easier not to swap weights too soon. So stay down, stay in that position, stay in that lunge position, and twisting over to the front leg, like so. It's ambitious, isn't it? I think Pam's right, we can get some more of it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, change legs. We know what we're doing, let's go. Those without the weights, relax that standing foot, get the movement really dynamic and bringing the arms. For those with the weights, have a look at what the others are doing. So this is what you'll be doing next. 
last few seconds. It's making really good. And time. Swap with your weights, buddy. It's all right. You know what we're doing? So lunges. We are going into a nice deep lunge, twist, and press. Come on, time has started. We're just doing one side. I'll be close to the other side. Stay low. Stay low. Stay, low. Stay in that lunge position. A good twist of the body. Shoulders are pulling your hands. I feel like somebody who's maybe added an extra ball to juggle with. <laughs> and time. Okay, change legs. Are we ready? Let's go. Make sure your feet are hip width apart, that'll give you more balance. And a wide base of support. Relax the standing foot runners. Lunges, can we go a little bit lower? We've only got 15 seconds. Let's go a little bit lower. Let's bend that back leg. Buddy. We're going to do running arms and squat and calf raise. Let's go. You're doing running arms, driving those elbows back, not letting the arms come too far forward. Oh, chest up. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, we said we're doing running arms. Oh, sorry. We're back to the beginning. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's, it's, it's probably me. Sleep for the last couple of days. Um, it's slightly my own fault. We may have parked in slightly the wrong place and received an angry note and a nail in the tyre. Oh, no! We haven't done a return journey. Alright, have a little rest. Squatters, we're staying low and, see, and um, raising one leg at a time. Where was this? You're doing running arms. No, where was this? Oh, where was this? Uh, uh, Horton in Ribblesdale. Okay, so, uh, uh, yes, nice and upright, let's go. Swing those arms back, drive the elbows, relax the shoulders. See Pam's going for 5k PB. <laughs> Relax the shoulders. 
So you want to keep the arms in that 90 degree position. Keep them, don't let them open out, just keep them in that 90 degree position. All right, and stop. Put you out of your misery. Okay, runners, running legs. With the weights, we're doing lunge. Uh, we're doing an isolated lunge, actually. Just down and up. Let's go. Head up, chest up, relax the standing foot. My watch is really cross with me. It's like, you have overreached yourself! <laughs> I just do 50k every five weeks or so. I can't understand why I'm so mad. Let's go. We get a little bit deeper with those lunges. Pushing up through the heel. Halfway. Rearranged again. We're going to need that poof out of the way. <laughs> like all the plans that they've put in, have they always been there? I've never noticed. No, yeah, it's definitely more homey. Yeah, yeah. All right, so let's change with our weights partners. You know what you're doing. Weights, people, you're just holding the weights and you're doing isolated lunge. You're checking how low you go. Running legs, off we go. Relax the standing foot, let's make the movement really dynamic. Oh, we're coming up. You're going down and up, yeah. She's not listening. No. It's not <laughs> <laughs> let's extend at the back as well. <clears throat> A few more seconds. Nice deep lunges there, everyone. It's going to be really nonsensical for the video, isn't it? <laughs> and time. No, we're now swapping legs. Now we're swapping legs. Runners swapping legs. Lunger swapping legs. Let's go. Relax the foot. Try not to grip the mat with your toes. <laughs> nice spleen. Fifteen seconds. Let's get a little bit deeper lunges. Let's make it more dynamic runners.
do it. It's going to have a deep lunge. Lovely leap. Deep lunge. <laughs> Very nice hip pictures. No bent legs there.
changed my tyre. And then he said, uh, and I asked him how much it was, he said, whatever you think. Change that. And you wouldn't be talked out of that stance. So. Tony B. <laughs> through the heel to standing, really working that posterior chain. And time. Okay, now, it's the second round, so we know exactly what we're doing. Let's go with the hip hitches, let's go to the windowsill. The pedal squatters on the mat. Are we ready? So let's have nice straight legs, hip hitches. Let's go. We're going to go through the rest because the timer didn't stop. So we just get, we get ready to change position to come and turn in. Squat low, lunge low, chest up. Alright, 
So the next round, a single leg. We're going to start off the left leg bouncing. All ready, let's go. Side to side. Back to forwards. Just up and up. Change legs. Side to side. Back to forwards. And time. Okay. Let's have, take our single weight. We're going to have the weight in the right hand. Right hand up. Right leg up. Let's go. Hinging from the hip. Pushing up through the heel, all the way to standing. Halfway. Don't worry if you can't get all the way to the floor, try to get back as flat as you can. Twist and raise, so right foot planted, twist and raise, opening up 
that left leg. Relax the foot, coming down into a little squat. Pushing up through the heel and opening up the left knee. Not long. Deep squat. Toes. And time. Okay. Let's have the band around our feet. We're going to do side line leg lift. I'll just close that while we get hold of the mat. Make sure your hips are stacked. Fifteen seconds. So don't worry so much about the range, just keep your hips stacked. Feeling it? Yeah. <laughs> All right. So we're going to do what we did last week, which is we're going to do the hamstring curl. So on your front, you want to have the band around one ankle and one foot, and you're curling up like so. So you want to grab the, the foot that you're curling with. That's where you have the, the band around the foot. So that was poor explanation. Let's go. Change legs. Are we ready? Let's go. If the band twists, it's worth yeah, just flattening it because it doesn't work very well once it's twisted round as I discovered last week.
we get a bit more range. Stopped, but let's call that time. It just sort of stopped in the middle. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> let's go back. Let's go back to the start. Up your pop. Come on. So bands around the feet, side steps. Let's go. I don't know why the phone just fell into a dream. Do I borrow mine? It's all right. <laughs> I know. It's the answer for that. Emergency, leave the building. <laughs> Standing tall, looking up. Get the knee up even higher. <laughs> really working the glutes at standing there. Yeah, I'm trying to help you. <laughs> yeah, I pick work with the hard bands. <laughs> <laughs> Right, it's always next time. Okay, so we are now down on the mat. Side lines. This time, we're going to lift your top leg and then our bottom leg comes to join it and we go both down. Lift, join, lower. Make sure you're completely side line.
Lots of good hip stabilisation exercises today. Well done. Okay, you can uh, shimmy out of your bands and we're staying on the mat. We're going straight into a plank. No time like the present. Come on, let's go. <coughs> Toes under, up into the plank position. I could be competitive. everybody. And time. And this time we're going to do plank to pike. So high plank position and plugging up and coming back to high plank position. We'll be held up until so we can press our legs back. Pressure heels towards the mat. <coughs> Pushing the front of the legs to the back. Ten seconds. And time. Okay. Mountain climbers, everyone's favourite. Oh, seconds. Come on, nearly there. Five. 
same time. Staying in this position, we're going to do V-sit. So your hands facing forward, feet off the ground, tucking in, and then you're going to push your feet away and onto your forearms. Let's go. Coming up, shoot away. seconds. Come on, let's make them go really work into the abs. Ten seconds, come on. Right, now if you've got your weights, you can do um, uh, you can do a row. Uh, yeah, maybe we can mix this up. Okay, so if you've got your weights, we're going to do a plank row, so like so, and like so. Uh, and maybe, I know, we'll do what we did last week. So we'll do row and then retrieve from the other side and row so you only need one weight let's get going does that does that make sense so you row you put it down
Get a good twist in the body. Let's go from 45 to 90. 